What's up streamers, it's Jason from The Streamable and every week we break down the biggest news in streaming. And this week, baseball is back and while you had to wait just a few months to get the season started, for the first time ever, all 30 Major League Baseball teams are available to stream locally with a streaming service. That's the good news. The bad news is there's been a lot of changes in the last year on just how you can stream those teams, so we're gonna break it down for you. Since there's been a major shakeup on just who carries your regional sports network, it is more confusing than ever. Most of those changes have to do with the fact that Fox Regional Sports Network has been dropped by a vast number of services. The good news is, is there's still a good alternative. Hulu Live TV at $55 a month still carries Yes Network and all the Fox Sports RSNs. They also are the least expensive option for the Cubs brand new regional sports sports network, Marquee Sports Network. It's not all bad news for baseball fans. There are now six teams that you were never able to stream without cable before that you can now stream locally thanks to new deals with AT&T TV Now. While you'll need their more expensive $80 max plan, you'll now be able to stream the Dodgers on Spectrum Sportsnet, Mason, which has the Orioles and Nationals, AT&T Sportsnet Rocky Mountain, which carries the Rockies, AT&T Sportsnet Pittsburgh, which carries the Pirates, and Root Sports Northwest. West, which carries the Mariners. There's finally a good option for fans of those teams. While it's not cheap, it's better than not having any option to stream. The only other major changes you really have to know about baseball this season really has to do with nationally televised games. Fubo TV now carries Major League Baseball Network as part of their Sports Extra plan and will be adding ESPN in August. One final note, one of the big additions in streaming last year was a new show called Change Up on DAZN, which was a red zone-like whip around show which took you to various baseball games. That show, which was hosted by Adnan Verk and Scott Rogowski, will not be returning for the 2020 season. We broke the news yesterday that it wouldn't be coming back, and we've since learned it's largely due to a dispute over just how much DAZN should pay in this abbreviated season. That's it for this week's edition of the Streaming Insider. Let us know what you think about all the changes with the regional sports networks. Are you going to try a new streaming service to watch your favorite baseball team? Make sure you give us a like and a thumbs up. And if you really like this, hit subscribe so you get next week's edition right when it comes out. Make sure you visit us all week at thestreamable.com for the latest in streaming news and reviews. As always, I'm Jason with The Streamable, and this has been The Streaming Insider.